In my last video, I made a pair of headphones and they were not very good, so I wanted to upgrade them. For this project, I don't want to use anything that's intentionally made for a speaker. I want it to be as homemade as possible. For custom parts, 3D printing makes the most sense, so I took advantage of it. And here is the print. It's got a spot in the middle, so we can put our magnets in, that should keep them from shaking, and we have one of these on each ear. And here is the cover. For the membrane, I decided to use some plastic from a binder. It worked better than I thought it would. I think what helps is we're not shaking an entire cup, just this little film. Now we need to connect both sides. On my previous headphones, it had a wire hanging from each ear, and I wanted to combine them. The trick is to use a hollow headpiece. We can feed the wire through, so all the connection is done on the left side. I also went ahead and stripped the wire instead of trying to tape it. This means it doesn't cut in and out anymore. So here's what the inside looks like. I added some spray rubber and this foam. I actually ended up taking the foam out later, which seemed to help, but you can see the stripped wire, the magnets, and the container. And this is what the wiring looks like. One lead from each goes to ground, and then the other goes to either right or left. Now we just need to epoxy everything together. Uh, it's not the cleanest look, but it does work. Um, and we can see the cord goes straight in, so it's just like a regular pair of headphones. So here they are. They're not adjustable, so they don't fit perfectly, but they're all right, and the sound quality is surprisingly not bad. Um, they are a little quiet, though. I have to turn my computer up to about 90 to hear. Uh, on regular headphones, that would be about 20 or 30. Um, but overall, considering what it's made of, I would consider this project a success.